God bless you today. I want to thank my Heavenly Father for an amazing Armageddon. Hold on, Sid. This is too good. I'm going to put you on hold. I want you to sing the whole song when we come back. <laughs> nobody. I mean, nobody's got callers this amazing. <laughs> Sid in Washington. Hatred is not strong enough of a word for those bureaucrats out there who would clamp down on freedom of speech. What I'm here to talk about, what am I here to say uh, today on the Ray Gun Show? <clears throat> well, let's see. Uh, anarchy, people! I'm trying to warn the world. You're all headed for anarchy. You're all headed for a terrible, terrible conflagration that's going to be so ugly that you're going to hate yourself in the morning. This is documented, this is biblical, this is real. But nobody listens to me. I feel like the guy in 12 Monkeys, you know Bruce Willis in that movie 12 Monkeys? He knows what's going to happen. He knows that billions will die. Now I'm not saying billions will die. But I am saying something terrible is about to <laughs> lower the guitarists. Thank you. Something terrible could happen, and you're going to be involved unless you drop out of this. You don't have to be in the anarchy. Stay home. Find some uh, old lost cassettes that you want to convert to digital. I don't know. Something else other than go out in the street and get hurt. Oh, boy. That's basically it. I just want to kind of tell you guys to chill out because the Bible says there's an anarchy coming and you're really in the, in the beginnings of it. I don't think you want to be a part of it. Remember Rwanda in 1994? That was probably a, a little bit of a sampling of it. So, yeah. Remember the French Revolution? You should read about that. You don't want to, yeah, you don't want to be a part of something like that. The Bible promises this is to happen. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Time waits for no one. Time waits for no one. We've got to build this world together or we'll have no more future at all because time Um, who's bold 
racist. You sound kind of like Ted Nugent. Well, they want us to keep fussing and fighting. Well, Sid Cano, how do people find you? Because I want to get you on as a guest, man. You're amazing. Hey, what do you think of that? That's amazing. Sid Canoe, the best ukulele player to ever play on Sunday Night Live.